Brad Pitt appears to have set his sights on the newly minted actress Andra Day. The 57-year-old Academy Award winner was spotted flirting backstage with the singer, 36, at the Academy Awards in April, a source told The Mirror on Saturday. Pitt's interest in the rising star comes amid his most recent victory in his ongoing custody battle with his ex-wife Angelina Jolie, 45, in which he scored joint custody. According to The Insider, Andra has been on Brad's radar for a while. Pitt reportedly fell under her spell after seeing her on the award circuit leading up to the small-scale Oscars ceremony at Los Angeles Union Station, where they allegedly caught up away from the camera's gaze. They were flirting backstage and are believed to have swapped numbers, the insider continued. It could be just professional, but some of Brad's pals have been talking about what a great couple they would make. Day first rose to prominence with the release of her acclaimed 2015 R&B album Cheers to the Fall, but she's become known more recently for her work on the big screen. Aside from the small roles in Marshall and Cars 3, both 2017, Day's biggest film to date has the United States vs. Billie Holiday, in which she plays the legendary jazz singer of the title. She went all in for the role in the Lee Daniels directed film by taking up smoking and starting to drink gin heavily. She confessed to PBS NewsHour in March that, it's probably one of the most unhealthy things I've done, though she thought the substances helped her emulate the gravel in Holiday's rough voice. Br. For the role she was awarded a Golden Globe Award and was even nominated for an Oscar. Brad's alleged meet-up with Day came just weeks before he won a major victory in court when he was granted joint custody of his children with Angelina Jolie. The decision was reportedly a major blow to the actress, as she was upset that the presiding judge didn't allow her or their children to testify. One person close to her claimed she did not object to the custody decision, but to a lack of care for her family, according to Page Six. It was added the star did not feel the court took into account the full set of issues that affect her family. The custody schedule was always determined by the court, the source explained. It's sad that Brad's people are gloating about a potential win when beating a system that exists to protect families and children from issues that harm their well-being is not something to brag about. They stress that Jolie wasn't simply trying to deprive Pitt, 57, of time with his children. The heart of this dispute has not been about keeping the children apart from their father, it's been Angelina asking for care for her family, they continued. Her motivations have never been to deny the children a relationship with their father. Complicating the court battle between the exes was Jolie's submission in court of evidence of allegedly domestic abuse by Pitt, which the Blast reported she planned to introduce back in March. The alleged evidence was recently submitted but it remains under seal and its exact contents are unknown. The Maleficent star is reportedly most upset over Judge John Alderkirk's decision to
overturned and Outerkirk is taken off the case. The process isn't over, and every step of the way Angie has resorted to extreme tactics to misrepresent her story, to the media, and to destroy anyone who goes against her, therapists, experts and even the judge, the source claimed. And at the end of the day, Angie was found not to be credible by all of these people. The insider also referenced reports that the once upon a time in Hollywood actor had been involved in a dispute on a private jet with his son Maddox, who was 15 at the time. She thought there would be charges brought against Brad after the plane incident, she dropped her lawyer Laurel Walser and claimed that Brad owed her millions in support, which was untrue, they claimed. They added that Joe Lee has made her children tools through the, court, process. The Academy Award winner has been known to bring all of her children to her red carpet premieres in the past, and even posed with the children in intimate photos taken at their L.A. home for British Vogue.